What makes a recommendation useful? Using the QM rubric to encourage excellence in online learning. Reviewing a colleague's online course can be a productive, helpful, relationship-building exercise. It can also be nerve-wracking, humbling, and unpleasant experience. In providing recommendations, using this admittedly subjective rubric, reviewers should follow the QM Helpful Recommendation Equation. Here you see the backbone of the equation, the way in which recommendations to your colleagues can be created and delivered in the spirit of the QM rubric. Continuous improvement, centered, collegial, and collaborative. Let's take a moment to examine each of the components for helpful recommendation. Standard. Read them all and understand the criteria used to determine met or not met. Understand that a standard can be met, yet a re recommendation can still be encouraged. When your course is being reviewed, you will always want to be seeking to improve, so go ahead, make suggestions within reason. Annotations dig deep into the standard by providing information about each standard, guidance for reviewers, and examples. Read these carefully. Course evidence is really important. This is where you pick out those specific areas of a course that may be improved by your recommendations. Be specific, not just additional instructional materials would be useful, but in Unit 1, Lesson 1, use of an online tool for outlining a student's project would be helpful and may help them to stay on track. The instructor may choose another path to get students to stay on track, but provide suggestions for the learner's perspective. Characteristics. This is where you need to tread softly. We all put so much effort into our work, and this needs to be acknowledged in the way in which feedback is provided. Begin with what you liked and end with what you liked. In the middle, adhere to the standards, clarify with annotations, bring in evidence from the course being reviewed, and be constructive, specific, measurable, sensitive, and balanced with your recommendations. Remember that we approach these reviews with an eye on continuous improvement. This equation will help you to provide useful recommendations to your colleagues that will enhance a learner's experience in their course. Let's hope the favor will be returned.